to another video my name is Anastasia if this is your first time watching welcome 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 so me and Tony's wedding anniversary two-year wedding anniversary is gonna be on Monday and so we are celebrating that this weekend and I'm going to take you all with us I'm gonna try to vlog as much as I can today is Friday and we are today we're just gonna kind of chill but we do have a couple's massage that we're going to at seven o'clock and I'm so excited about that y'all. He wanted to plan the whole weekend out, but I had originally told him I didn't want to do nothing Friday. I was like, I kind of just want to chill, relax, you know, vibe out. And then he was planning the, you know, the anniversary. So the remainder of the weekend. So anyways, I out of the blue was like, Ooh, let's go do a massage. So I ended up finding a massage therapist that could get us in for a couple's massage and that's where we'll be today. And then tomorrow he's got it planned out as to what we're gonna do tomorrow. I'm excited, like I'm so excited y'all. I just cannot believe it's already been two years. This has been such a beautiful journey like I shared with y'all before. Marriage is such a beautiful thing. When you're blessed to share it with your soulmate and when you're blessed to share it with your best friend. So the outfit I originally ordered, I did not like. So I didn't order this other outfit from Fashion Nova and paid for overnight shipping. And at this point, I'm just risking it all because I don't even know if I'm going to be able to fit it. I don't know if I'm going to like it. So I waited to get on camera to open it. And I'm like dying to open this right now. Y'all don't know how hard it is for me to not open a package as soon as I get it. But I was like, I'm going to wait and open it with the girls. So here we are. And I'm trying to hear it before my camera dies. Oh, God, I think this might be a little... Oh. Oh, this is good material. Oh, this is cute. Let me show you. Let me back up so y'all can see it. Oh, I got to make sure I don't get oil. It's cute. It's got like the feathers. And it's got like the little scrunch. And then there's a train on the back. So it's short in the front. This train is, this is some good quality stuff. Oh, Lord, I didn't expect the train to be this long. Oh, this is pretty though. I gotta try this on, y'all. And I got it in a size medium. Cause y'all know I told y'all I'm good for ordering things too big and then having to ship. Let me find my phone because I want to show y'all how it looked in the picture. This is how I looked on the picture. So that train, it like spreads out like that. I think this is gonna be so cute. I can't wait to put this on. Don't mind my bed, y'all, because I have not made my bed, okay? She's not on top of things today. <laughs> That's one thing I don't mind stepping out of my comfort zone with is my clothes, baby. I will wear pretty much anything. Like, as long as I like the way it fits my body, I'm going to wear it. Especially if it's different, I'm going to wear it. Let me go ahead and try that on because I don't know why, but I just got scared. <laughs> and I will hop back on here in a second to let y'all know what I think about it. I'm so excited, guys. <laughs> This is the outfit I'm wearing. It's kind of big, um, but it's just this two piece set I got from Forever 21. Um, the top is a bodysuit, which I love. And then y'all know I love me a comfortable outfit. And it's just the biker shorts. And it's like that faded, or I don't know what you would call this black, but it's kind of like that faded black, I guess. And let me go ahead and head out because like we are really forcing the time right now. I don't know how long we're about to be looking for him something to wear as far as this shirt. And I don't know how long it's going to take me to find some shoes. So let me not waste any more time. We're going to head out and I will catch y'all when we get to the massage place. Usually I don't post. Usually I don't post, but I want the world to know. Time to pull a drop top out. Summer nights, it's a vibe, yeah. Been keeping it in the house, Netflix and chilling. I GDM and gay. Didn't want to share my love till I found someone I'm sure of. Young and untamed, I've been out of range, keeping it low. But I want to be bold with it. Don't care who we told about it. Wow, baby, got a hold on it. Let love on for tonight. They'll be calling us gold. You know, like, bear with it. Let them stare at it. 
y'all. It is 9.15 a.m. And I don't know if I told y'all, but we are going to the Uncle Nearest Distillery today. Y'all, I'm so excited. For those that don't know, this is a Black-owned distillery. And they are located in Shelbyville, Tennessee. So y'all know she had to plan a whole outfit for this, right? Because, wait, what did I just drop? Like, I'm thinking, like, what's distillery vibes? They was like, it's going to be a lot of walking. And I think they said we're going to walk, like, half a mile to a whole mile. Maybe. Comfortable. Okay? Comfortable. So, this is the look I went with. I've actually had this outfit for some time. The top came from Sheen. The bottoms came from H&M. I got these while I was visiting family in St. Louis, actually. And I love these shorts, y'all. They're so cute. And they have, like, the pockets on them as well y'all know i love pockets so that's what i'm wearing and then i'm wearing my shoes y'all i love these shoes i'm just wearing my bracelet this is kate spade and this is <laughs> tj maxx i was gonna wear a necklace but i changed my mind and then instead of wearing studs i stepped out my comfort zone and i've been buying hoops so i'm wearing my hoops today i forgot i was gonna tell y'all about our experience at the <laughs> massage yesterday when we got our couple's massage so it was okay um the massage was great. I'll just say that the massage was great. As far as the ambiance and I don't know, I didn't really care for the place. I'm just going to be honest with y'all. First red flag for me was, baby, they didn't have me sign no papers. Y'all didn't ask me if I had any injuries. Y'all didn't ask me if I had any allergies. <laughs> like, I've been to several spas and always had to fill out papers, you know, for them to get information, honey. No, ma'am. They got us in there, we walked in, went straight to the back. And then once we got back there, they asked us what target areas they wanted, we wanted them to massage. So that was a red flag for me. I don't know if it's just me, call me a mean girl, but when I'm going to get pampered, I don't want to talk the entire time. And I want to relax and chill and just zen out. This woman talked to me the entire time, y'all. Tony's woman didn't really talk to him. She was just getting the job done as she should. My girl, baby, she wanted to have girl time, tea time, talk time. And I just was like, oh my God. It was one time I tried to act like I was snoring so she think I was asleep, but she kept talking to me. I was like, ah. She did a dang good job. She was very good at what she do, but yeah, I don't think I will go back there. And then I don't know if they were short staffed, but the, the massage was 60 minutes. Mind you, the phone was ringing. They stopping and going to answer the phone and in the front taking appointments. I'm like, what is this? When I was shocked that they were able to work us in <laughs> that quick, I think I know why. I think I know why. It was in a good area. It was over by the mall and stuff. It was a good area, but yeah, I don't, I don't think I'll be back. Um, I'm going to let that one go. I just had to update y'all on that as well. Okay, let me head out. <laughs> They have dental floss, and then they make sugar floss, all right? So you make kind of candy with sugar floss. You have Boone Pies. Boone Pies is a traveling baker. Went by a coal mining operation and asked what they like to have as a snack. Had a full moon outside. Guy walked outside, said, I'd like to have something big as that moon, but I need you to put that in my lunch pail. Called it a moon pie. The little Debbie Cakes, we've all had probably too many of them. The cool thing about that is that when he sold that company, only stipulation he had was to keep his granddaughter the face of the brand. That's that little girl on there, you see. It's his granddaughter. Moon pie, uh, Mountain Dew. Mountain Dew was two brothers make a moonshine mixture, right? So a lemon-lime mixture. Now, we're talking about moonshine. Not today's moonshine. Not lemon-lime and cherry and apple pie and all that. I'm like, real shine. It's called corn liquor, right? Had that really oily taste back here when you drink it. We need to cover that up, that lemon-lime mixture. Uh, uh, may I work a shift? You ain't got no revenue out here. I don't think so. Not yet. I haven't met everybody yet, but I think we're all good. Yeah. We're good? Yes, ma'am. All right. All right. So we're going to go inside. All right. So we go in here. The only thing you can't do, you can't video us. You take all the pictures we you want. We just ask you not to video, okay? It's good outside right now. We are officially on the tour. On the tour. How do you like it so far? I'm really, you know what I'm saying? Unc got a nice place. He you know does. what I mean? It's beautiful out here, guys. You need to show nephew something. Maybe <laughs> I make my own jump one day. 
and they took us in a room. I had to turn my camera off, but they showed us the video, the history, how it all started, how he was an entrepreneur way back then. I just love stuff like this, y'all. I know me not. And he a big put Jack Daniels on. And did. Jack Daniels is not the originator. At He's all. a duplicator. I'm not he just a got big, famous. I'm not a big history person, but when it comes to my roots, I'm here for it. And they also talked about women getting have um how it all played out about them getting the rights to vote. It's just crazy. But let me get back to the tour, guys. He said I can video things, but he don't want me to put the camera on him. So Oh, I also took that tag off my head because I seen it once I got off camera earlier. The Humble Bay Folks is the home of the world's longest bar. All right? At 518 feet long in here, 17 bar wells, a stage, a dance floor, and an amphitheater. So out here, all right, this summer we're looking at having four to 10,000 guests. Okay? But in here also, G. Garvin on the Food Network channel is already working with Vaughn and he put together our high end bar menu in here. So you definitely gotta go in here and see this. So here's how it works. So right now, let me say this, Columbia, Tennessee, 30 miles from here, they're running all of our whiskey half since 2017, called Tennessee Distilling Group. So they're just a hired hand, all right? They have 13 brands over there that you think have a distillery. They don't, all right? They rely on them to make their whiskey. So we were their smallest brand, now we're their largest brand. Awesome barrels. Who's the first one? Oh. All right, so a little bit about this barrel house. And you take all the photos you want. You just can't touch them. These are full of whiskey. They're only scotched up with this little thing. See how it comes out? So that's 500 pounds that rolls out on you. Is, this whiskey is, you need to treat it um, gently. Gently. <laughs> <laughs> that's a good word. I'll tell you right now, if you don't treat that gently, you go out here in this seat, it will treat you badly. You <laughs> strong. Caramel. Yeah. Money. I'm watering. Oh, a little bit. So you're going to get more, you're going to get that little sweet vanilla. No, real quick. It's going to pick up with some caramel, but it's going to have that oak pop yeah. very fast. And you're going to have this long, yeah, it's long it's spicy finish coming down through here right now. Shit, all right? Oh my what God. just happened is, your brain just told your hand, all right, here at 11 o'clock, that ain't sweet tea. Sugar get to this one. Uh, a really nice kind of a, a toffee note with the oak. The finish is very, it's not, it's not long, and the finish is very thick, whiskey forward. All right, and now you're getting a little tingling sensation right here, like an all spot skin on the side of your tongue. All right, so these next three are only so here, all right? Nowhere else in the world. It's only so here. It's only so here at the okay? So this is called Master Land. How cute the boots are, guys. It's like you have your own little section, and you just go in. I love that for us. It's getting very much privacy. Yeah. I got a loaded baked potato, which looks amazing. Guys, I have been craving a loaded potato for so long. Listen, it's about to go down. Chicken nachos. And I got some bread pudding. So they have the, the different types of liquor in these like glass barrels. This is so adorable. Listen. This right here is what you call details, okay? And they're lit up in the back. Let me find the restroom, guys, because I have to go really bad. How cute is this little sink? This is adorable. It goes with the vibe for sure. Cute. And look at my new phone case, guys. I found this at TJ Maxx. Love that. I saw my screen on the last video I did. I said, ew, my phone is disgusting. So I had to clean it up. I got a new screen protector too. A new phone case. Love that for me. Playing dresses. Going all to different places, different planets. Watch your aura pass me by. Losing balance. What if we were out of time and second chances? Empty handed. Do we? Yeah. What? Why? 
what? This is our room. We finally arrived to the hotel, guys. We are staying at the AC Hotel, Nashville, downtown. We're supposed to have a king bed, but for some reason we ended up with two queens. I love how they have this TV set up with this little, let me move my bag. It's like this little bench that goes under. And he's got the light in the floor, baby details. Love that. And this is the bathroom. Super cute. I am loving this black. Man, you want to do my bathroom black. You hear me, Tony? That would, that would be pretty dope. But if we have a black bathroom, if we got a black bathroom, that's even better. Oh my god. Okay guys, so I just finished curling my hair. I decided to do something different. I feel like I always do the same old thing. The body care, the body curls are either flattering, but this time I did like a wand curl and I kind of pulled them apart. I have to show y'all the curl I was going for. It definitely didn't turn out like that, but I think it still turned out really cute. I did my makeup and now I'm about to put my clothes on and we're about to head out and go to dinner. Um, and we are going to take y'all with us to dinner. So you guys stay tuned. Y'all, I'm so happy my hair turned out good. I was really worried about that. I haven't did wand curls in years. So I was like, hmm, to chance it or not to chance it. But I love it. So let me go and get my clothes on. We're actually going to Uber down to the restaurant instead of driving. The weather right now is terrible. It's like super rainy cloudy ugh, it's a mess we've decided just to uber we're not that far from the restaurant that way we don't have to worry about parking or tony having to walk in the rain and we're just going to get dropped off and picked up so this is the finishing look guys um and then this is the dress it's from fashion nova it's the one i was showing you guys that i just love so it's like a peach color it said pink but it looks peach to me kind of a very light peach this dress is freaking gorgeous Y'all know on my channel, I'm always gonna show y'all unique styles. I love unique things. Okay, star, Thank superstar. You. Thank you, it's got the train on the back, honey. She has arrived. Get the red carpet out, guys. She's here. <laughs> that is the look, girls. You look like a star. Thank you, babe. Very simple look as far as my makeup. Just very natural, I didn't wanna do too much. But yeah, guys, this is the finishing look. I'm so excited about it. I love, love, love this. This definitely screams anniversary to me. <laughs> and then this is what Tony's wearing. You look so cute. You think so? Yeah. We look good. And we're celebrating two years. Shooting for a lifetime. Dos años. That's how you said it? Two years. Dos años? Dos años. Dos años. <laughs> But yeah, we're about to head out. So the plan is we want to get pictures here and um, not so much at the restaurant because that restaurant be busy. We're going to Eddie B's. So yeah, let's go guys. Catch y'all when we get there. So we made it to the restaurant. It's super beautiful in here. However, there's a band playing and we're right in front of the freaking band. Literally. So, I won't be able to vlog. They're taking a break right now. I won't be able to vlog because it's like super loud. And they were putting in a request to move our table upstairs, but it was going to be another 30 minutes. And we refused to wait. So, I'm going to show y'all the food and we'll just talk about the food when I get back to the room because we're about to be loud.
Honda, Shelby Drive, look alive, look alive, niggas came up on this side, now they on the other side, oh well, fuck them dog. we gon' see how hard they ride, I get racks to go outside, and I spit it with the vibes, we up on the other side, niggas actin' like we tied, I been gone since like July, niggas actin' like I died, they won't be expecting shit when Come play ball with me! Please. Uh, uh, uh. Yeah, the food was so good last night. The first Uber driver we took sucked. He was so rude. He put us in danger where he dropped us off at. So I gave him a horrible rating and I always tip Uber drivers. He did not get a tip. And I gave him a horrible rating. He was so rude. Um, even when we got in the car, he didn't say nothing. Nothing. Um, and it ended up being pretty nice. Tony seen a rapper in there and he just went ballistic. He went crazy. I don't even know who the rapper was. I just know. He was a little starstruck. Yeah, he was super excited. I didn't know the dude. He couldn't quote me not one song. I'm just saying. But you could have told me the song and I could have decided if I knew or not. It was Freddie Gibbs. Yeah. Freddie Gibbs. So, he wanted to go up and shake his hand. I told him not to. Let him eat dinner. As a celebrity, I feel like they don't have any time, like any privacy. So, Tony didn't like that. Why you always throw me on the bus? I didn't throw you under the bus. Give me some love. <laughs> oh, boy. <laughs> Why your nostrils flare out like that? <laughs> Why you gotta say it like that? Why you just can't say barbecue? Why you gotta say barbecue? Barbecue. You sound like an old man. <laughs> I'm so mad I didn't pack a better swimsuit. I honestly didn't think we were going to come and swim because it said it was gonna rain. So I just threw one in here just in case. I'm not standing here, Tony, it's too hot. It's making me sweat. Hey girl, so it is later on in the day. It is Sunday still. Um, I got home and I realized I never showed y'all my shoes last night. I was like, why didn't I show them my shoes? That was the best part. So let me show y'all my shoes because they're so cute. I found them at Marshall's. How cute are these, guys? Let's get into this shoe. Ah! I love this shoe. Uh, this is so adorable. So adorable. But yeah, I found these at Marshalls. I think they were like $40. And y'all already know. Snatched them. Snatched them. So stinking cute. And they really didn't hurt my feet too bad. Now, when it started to rain and my feet got wet, you know how that friction from your feet sliding, that was annoying. But for the most part, they didn't even really hurt my feet. The heel's not too big. I'm not sure how many inches the heel is, but it wasn't too bad. But I just thought these were so cute. I can't believe I didn't show y'all these. So I hope you guys enjoyed this vlog. Sorry it was shorter, but I wanted to enjoy my weekend. <laughs> I'm not gonna lie to y'all. I wanted to enjoy the moment um, as we celebrated our love. Two years, toast to us. Our anniversary is actually tomorrow, but it was definitely a beautiful weekend. Like I had so much fun. That's one of the things I think I love most and value most about my husband is that we can just be ourselves with each other, just cut up. And it's like literally hanging with your best friend. Like I love, love, love it. So had a great time, but thank you all so, so much for watching. I hope you all liked this video. Um, moving forward, I'm going to continue to bring styles, but I want to start my channel, I've realized, and I'm going to add this to my description, is going to be like unique styles. I've always been a very unique person when it comes to clothes. I've always loved going in stores and shopping for however long it takes to piece an outfit together um, or just to find things that are different. So that's what you all will find on this channel. Y'all are going to find unique styles. Your girl got monetized. I didn't think I shared that with y'all yet, but I had to share that with you guys. Thanks to you all, your girl got monetized. I am so excited. I still can't believe it. Let's just be honest. I still can't believe it. It took me a minute. I had to digest it before I shared it. But thanks to you all, your girl has gotten monetized, baby. So just like I promised y'all, we going up.
I'm gonna start linking more things below. Yes, thank you all so, so much. I would not be monetized if it was not for y'all and y'all support. It means so, so much to me. Thank y'all. And we, I promise y'all will regret it. We are going up on this channel every day, every video. I'm gonna perfect my craft. My goal is to get better and better. And it's just so many things happening so quick behind the scenes. Like, it's like, wow, <laughs> wow. So. Yes, thank you all so, so much. Like I said, it would not have been possible without you guys. Um, so yeah, let me go for it because I feel like I'm about to start crying. But thank y'all for watching. Be sure to subscribe to my channel. Be sure to like, comment, share my videos. Uh, tell your family to subscribe, whoever. Y'all feel will enjoy my content. Tell them to come join the gang. Thank you all so, so much. Hope y'all having a great Sunday and your girl will see you in the next vlog. Bye.